since I brought it, since you're bringing it to form another impressive video showing how to achieve a great kill set while being part of the teammate. What's going on YouTube? If you don't know who I am and if you don't know what I'm all about, my intro pretty much covers it. Uh, at least as a commentator. Um, let me break it down for you because I know my intro is kind of fast, but that's the general gist of what I go for in commentaries. My name is Mike, but I go by I brought a tent, and um, the name speaks for itself, really. Uh, I like to camp, but I'm a strategical camper. Uh, I like to camp when necessary and plant and rush when necessary. Um, so at times you'll see me camp, like for example, like right now. But that's only because I don't believe that you know you should fucking go risk your life going to plant you know bombs that are pretty much unachievable. I mean, for example, uh, if you guys have played Modern Warfare 2. And uh, you you were playing demolition, or even I think search in uh, uh, Afghan. I mean the B bomb or the A bomb, whatever the one that was outside the plane. It was damn near impossible to plant. And to me, that's that seems irrational. You know, when you could easily go to a third round, plant the bomb, and defend it as, like immediately. You know, and that's just my thought process. I'm a very strategic kind of player. So I will rush when necessary and plant when necessary, but I will also camp when necessary and build kill streaks when necessary. That's who I am as a gamer. I'm a strategic kind of guy. So know that about me now. Anyways, guys, uh, but like for example, um, th this flag I believe is the A bomb. It's damn near impossible to catch or plant. I mean, simply because. They, their, their spawn is literally inside that little cave. It, it's fucking impossible to plan it or it's pretty damn impossible. I, I wouldn't say impossible because nothing is impossible. Um, but yeah, so anyways you guys, a little bit more about me. Um, I like to, I guess you could say break down spawn points. Um, if I can, I will try to teach you the best that I know of my ability. Uh, to try to inform you guys, I, I know there's a lot of commentators out there like T. Martin that will try to break down spawns, but I believe that you can't really tell unless you're actually in the gameplay while it's happening. Like, um, for example, like right now, like I'm about to go ham on these guys. Like right now, I know that they're spawning on my left hand side right now. Look, there's one, there's two, and right in front of me, if you pay close attention, three people spawn at the same exact time. That's a spawn point on this map. Not an, and another one. And you know that's that, that's just how I roll. <laughs> Anyways, you guys. Um. So that's that's how I try to I guess inform my subscriber base or my you know my viewers. Um. You know to to kind of progress at this game. There's a lot of people that you know tend to believe that rushing is the only way to play. Um. You know even though yes it is a little bit more fun, but as for me as a gamer or as even a competitor. Um, I'm a very competitive person. I always like to win. Um, you know, I'm not saying that I will cry if I lose, but you know, I'm always trying my best to win at this game. Um, just because, you know, it's in my competitive nature, damn it. And, um, you know, a lot of people say, oh, but rushing is technically more fun or, or whatever, you know, but for me, uh, you know, killing people and, you know, doing good at the game and, you know, kind of distorting my enemies, it's a thrill in itself. It's like a game within a game. And uh, that to me is fun. You know, winning is fun. And uh, you know, th and the, the the best you know the best way I've found to win is to build kill streaks, destroy and disorientate the enemy, and and piss them off to the point where they'll rage quit, they'll start screaming, and it'll believe it or not, it will affect their game style. I'm sure that you guys have dealt with campers. You know, you'll you've dealt with me. But for example, like right now, I'm trying to plant the bomb, and I'm going in there rushing. You know, I'm not expecting to get a Moab, which, spoiler alert, I do get, but, um, you know, I'm, I'm rushing in there, trying to clear out their spawn, trying to get out, going around, trying to see if I can kill anybody that's potentially going into that cave, seeing if we can get a plant off, but if we can't, then we can't, you know, we might as well just wait for the third round. I mean, for sure, without a doubt, if you're rolling with, within a team, you know, a team of six or five even, um, you'll, you'll, odds are you'll get the plant off before the uh, opposing team, you know, with a bunch of randoms. Um, just simply because if you're rolling with a team of five, odds are you'll have, like, every one of you will have a mic, and it'll be easier to orchestrate a way to, you know, get the, the plant off, or anything else for that matter, get the diffuse. So, yeah. Anyways, guys, another thing I tend to like to do is, you know, bring excitement to my, my gameplay. Um, so I'll try to commentate. 
even though right now, for example, it'll, it won't be the most exhilarating commentary. Like, for example, like right now I'm laying down. I'm focused. I'm trying to get that Moab, you know, trying to get that little countdown, you know, that burp, 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 you know, that epic countdown is here. That Moab go off. I'm, I'm laying down. I hear somebody trying to shoot my teammate. Oh, I save him. Oh, oh, I save him. I'm, I hear somebody coming out. What can it be? Like one, the two, the three. And, <laughs> and you know, I go a little crazy with the commentaries, but I try to, it's because I really like to do them. Anyways, you guys, this video is pretty much coming to an end. I right, uh, hope you enjoyed my commentary because I know that there's going to be a, a, a few of you that are like, Oh my God, this guy is fucking annoying. And then there's going to be the other, the other guys that are like, Holy shit, I really dig this guy's commentating style. You know, it's either you love me or you hate me. So for all the haters, I love you. And for all the lovers, I love you too. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, like I said, if you like my commentating style, feel free to check out my video. I'm sure that... You know, I'll have a link in the video itself or in the description below. Also, I do roll with the Twitter, so uh, please follow me. Uh, it's the same exact thing as my YouTube channel, so when you check out my YouTube channel, please follow me on Twitter as well, because you know the YouTubes be fucking up. This has been I Brought a Tense, signing out.